A few years shy of becoming centurions, three weather-worn homes on a dirt lot behind the World Trade Center are being ripped from their foundations. Now, the homes have found new homes, where, it is hoped, they will thrive for another hundred years. The spot where the homes sit, off the Broadway exit of the 710 freeway, has been slated for redevelopment under the city's massive West Gateway project now unfolding. Now this is the biggest house. This is a two-story house. Right. Been, well, so. it, it's interesting. The one in the back, they call it the airplane home, that's also a two-story. Oh, this yeah. little yellow home has kind of a story and a half. But yeah, this is the monstrosity. We thought, well, let's start with the biggest. Now, at midnight is because they have to clear the streets, or is that a special yeah. permit? That LA County only... Transportation, they issue okay. a permit. After a day's worth of work, workers tilted stop signs and lifted power lines to get the homes prepared and on their way heading down Daisy to Broadway on their way to their new locations. And here's a counter right here. This is obviously what's left of the kitchen. Sink down there. Excuse us, Grandma. Coming in. Sorry. Oh, dry. Here's one of those closets where you can see the people under the stairs. This is what remains, with the rest of the roof sitting on the house, sitting on the ground over there. They had to take the roof off to remove it, so they can get it down the street and uh, not have to move the expensive fiber optic lines that are in its way. With the uh, homes now in place in their new location, the city hopes to now find buyers who don't mind spending a few dollars to refurbish the historic dwellings.